All right. In this video, I want to show you how to troubleshoot your Wemo Smart Clock if it's not responding on the Apple Home app. So here's my Wemo Smart Clock right here. I can see it here on the Apple Home app. Okay, so it's not responding. So to troubleshoot this issue, the first thing you want to do is to unplug your Smart Clock and plug it back in. So let's unplug it. Okay, and now we need to wait a few seconds and plug it back in. Okay, so let's plug it back in. All right. And I want to go back to the home app. So let's check if the plug is back online, if it's not responding. So in my case, it's not back online, it's still not responding. So in this case, the next thing you want to do is to remove the smart plug from the home app and set it up again. So to do this, select the smart plug. And I can see the gear icon here, so tap this. Now scroll a bit down, so you can see remove accessory. Tap this and tap remove. Okay. So the smart plug has been removed. And now we need to add it up again. But before you do this, go over here and make sure your Bluetooth is turned on. Also, you want to go to your Wi-Fi settings and make sure you're connected to the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi. All right, now let's go back to the home app, open it, and go back to your smart plug. Now you want to press the power button to put the plug in pairing mode, so press it once. Okay, and now you can see the LED light flashing orange and white, meaning the plug is now in pairing mode, ready to connect. So let's go back to the home app, okay, right here, and now you want to tap the plus icon here. Okay, now get your phone and take it closer to your smart plug this way. Okay, found it. And now you want to tap add to home. So tap this. Okay, so it's setting up and it's going to take a few minutes. Okay, so the setup is almost complete. And now you want to select the location of your plug. So in my case, I want to go for living room and I'll tap continue. So tap here to rename your plug. And once you're done, tap continue. Okay, now you want to select how you want it to display. And once you're done, tap continue and tap done. Okay, so let's check if the plug is back online, if it's now responding. So Okay, so you can see it's back online and it's now responding. So that's how to troubleshoot your Wemo smart plug if it's not responding on the Apple Home app. Okay, so I hope this video was helpful. And if so, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.